Yeah, no, I think when you look at the history itself, um, we African, uh, we are known to not to write our history. Um, most of our, our way of being taught um, how things came about is through oral history. And um, most of us, we do know that um, if a story is, is told by a third person, it's not the same as it was told by the, the original person. So that's where the problem comes with our history in Africa, because most of us, our history was written by uh, people who were not African, unfortunately. And of course, I do always say thanks to them that we, of course, we still have a bit that is written about us. But uh, at the end of the day, some way, somehow, if you look at the history book, there are some things that we lost. Because when history was written by, be it the Germans, be it South African, or be it the first missionary that came, to Africa was that they write it, they, they wrote it according to their own perception, to their own well-being and to the way how they want to influence the, that local or that specific community in which directed to go. So I think that's where that's where the problem came in. But I always think that of course the books that we had in schools, of course it, uh, we were told about the, the history, of course we, we, we had to know a bit about the history of who, who colonized, who, who did colonize Namibia and also about the history of where we come from. But um, at the end of the day, in terms of the influence that they had, of course, to many learners, as um, my colleague have mentioned, that the influence of the European was so much until um, the 1980s. You know, So there are so many learners that went through this education system, be it even our father, be it like some of us also, when we started school, there were still Africans being taught at school. So you can imagine the type of influence that this type of history had on us. But we do have a lot of, um, after independence, of course, government saw that we need to produce Namibian, we need to, put, to, to be taught um, in English, and also some of us, or some of the learners have been taught in their local languages. I think that's important, and that's a shift um, from what we were taught before, before independence.